Lower respiratory infections are a group of disease which affects lower respiratory tract, including trachea, bronchi, and lungs. Lower respiratory infections are fifth most common cause of death in the world. There are three most common types of lower respiratory infections, bronchitis, bronchiolitis, and pneumonia. We will compare them, uh, we will discuss similarities, treatment, hallmarks, cause, and prognosis. Uh, let's start with symptoms. Most common symptoms of bronchitis include persistent cough uh, with often clear or yellow or green mucus, mild fever and chills, chest discomfort or tightness, short of, uh, shortness of breath or dyspnea on physical activity, fatigue and wheezing. Symptom of bronchiolitis usually uh, involves a runny nose and congestion, mild fever, cough, rapid breathing or difficulty breathing, wheezing or cyanosis. And pneumonia symptoms include productive cough, usually yellow, green or bloody mucus, shortness of breath, chest pain, usually when coughing or breathing deeply, fatigue and weakness, confusion, particularly in all adult, uh, in all older adults. Uh, hallmark of bronchitis, bronchitis is um, ronchi, which, which is coarse rattling sound uh, during auscultation and wheezing during auscultation. Prolonged expiratory pace, normal or decreased tactile uh, fremitus. Uh, in case of uh, bronchiolitis, diffuse wheezing and crackles during auscultation is common. Tachypnea or rapid breathing is also common and retraction, inward movement of the chest wall during breathing and nasal flaring is. In case of pneumonia, hallmarks are uh, crackles or rails during auscultation, dullness during percussion uh, over the affected area. It's usually on specific area of lung. Uh, increased tactile fremitus, which means we, uh, felt of vibration on the chest uh, during breathing. Uh, and uh, important is uh, bronchitis usually affects adults. Uh, who are smokers or have asthma or other chronic lung problems. Bronchiolitis affects usually kids less than two years old and sometimes it uh, affects also newborns. Uh, pneumonia usually affects kids or older people usually 65 or more. Uh, causes bronchitis most commonly is caused by viral infections like influenza virus, rhinovirus, adenovirus. Sometimes it can cause by bacteria, mycoplasma pneumonia, bordetella pertussis in case of whooping cough. Uh, bronchiolitis causes include respiratory syncytial virus, human uh, metapneumonia virus, and rhinovirus. In case of pneumonia, causes can be bacteria, streptococcus pneumonia, it is most common cause of pneumonia, hemophilus influenza, mycoplasma pneumonia, and from viruses, influenza virus, respiratory syncytial virus, and COVID-19 also common. Uh, duration of the disease, uh, bronchitis, usually lasts from one to three weeks. If it lasts more than three weeks, it can be considered chronic bronchitis. But sometimes uh, symptoms, uh, uh, usually main disease is already recovered in three weeks, but symptoms can last much more than one to three weeks. Uh, and uh, if uh, symptoms uh, of bronchitis are recurrent and uh, persistent uh, for at least three months per year, uh, four to consecutive years, it is called chronic bronchitis. 
duration of bronchiolitis typically is two to three weeks now with the most severe symptoms occurs at first week duration of pneumonia usually is one to three weeks uh, but in severe cases uh, it can last for several months and it can uh, it it may need hospitalization of course prognosis most cases of acute bronchitis recover fully but chronic uh, bronchitis have risk developing of COPD or chronic obstructive pulmonary disease uh, prognosis of bronchiolitis is usually very good and it fully recovers prognosis of uh, pneumonia usually also good and uh, persons fully recover but here is most important developing countries where people have no accessibility for medical service for antibiotics that's why so many uh, deaths from uh, lower respiratory infections treatment of bronchitis include supportive care usually no need specific treatment uh, it includes rest hydration or the counter medications for symptom relief such as cough suppressants fever reducers uh, chronic uh, bronchitis uh, for chronic bronchitis bronchodilatators inhaled corticosteroids and pul pulmonary rehabilitation uh, is recommended and uh, with pulmonary re re uh, rehabilitation and bronchodilators uh, improve of lung function is possible that's important point uh, treatment of bronchiolitis include also supportive care hydration fever management and monitoring breathing difficulties in severe cases uh, severe cases for hospitalization oxygen therapy and sometimes antiviral medications is needed for example ribavirin for severe uh, uh, respiratory syncytial virus uh, infections and the treatment of pneumonia usually are uh, antibiotics it's standard treatment for bacterial pneumonia in severe cases hospitalization and supportive care is important uh, such as oxygen therapy and mechanical ventilation if necessary uh, there is no usually no specific treatment uh, for viruses but of course we have some uh, antiviral medications uh, first line treatments in case of bacterial um, uh, pneumonia is macrolides such as azithromycin and clarithromycin, doxycycline and